Greetings from the frozen tundra of Slam Bone Field in Green Bay, Wisconsin, where legends like Slicks Bombardi and Threat Carb thrilled crowds stuffed with beer and cheese. We're sure to see some more classic action today if time doesn't freeze. And this is going to be a bloody game. The teams are loading their weapons and sharpening their spikes. The New Orleans Zombies battle. The Grim Bay Attackers. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. See that move, baby? I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see that because I'm too fast. <laughs> Hope you got your mutant tailgate buzz on. I know I did. The teams are revving up on the sidelines, and we are ready for some mutant football. Grim Blitzer along with Bricks and Bricks Jr. Yeah, Grim, I had a little eye open at myself at the mutant bloodmobile park next to the taco truck outside. Pulled a lobotomy shot. Raccoon rabies blood and red bull crap. Hoo-hoo. Yeah, I can tell your mouth looks like a hot shaving cream dispenser. Gets the ball, get the first down, and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. And it's first and ten. And that pass is good for about five yards. Second down and five. Sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time, Grim. I just may be in commentary, but I thought you were supposed to throw the ball forward. Uh, yeah, 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 you're right. You should. Second down and ten. Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sinners then. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. And it's first and ten. First down. Give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. And it's first and ten. And the defense gives up five yards there. Second down and five. And that's a sack. The quarterback has to get rid of the ball there. Hey, man, I was hitting on the now. You know what happened? Third down and, well, good luck. First down! He was not going to drop that one. 
They need to make him a target more often. And it's first and ten. He's not just burning down the house, he's taking it to the house. And into the end zone with a burst of speed. I think he's more of a downer's guy than a speed thing, Brent. He's running from his name, as it's clear. Seriously, man, you think you'd go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? You get my grill, I'll ruin your world. Ruin it. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? Straight through the uprights. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. It's first and ten. He grabs it and picks up four on that reception. Second down and six. Hit, and the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into 300 pounds of ground mutant meat. And you can't hit a guy much harder than that. And that is unfortunate. And that's the way to get the sticks moving. He picks up five yards on that play. Second down and five. Well, it looks like he wanted to run before he caught it. You gotta keep your eye on the ball. Come on, you dirtbag. You gotta make that catch. Third down and five. Oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, it sounds like my offseason. And they'll line up for the punt here. And the punter has one job to do, and that's pump the ball. Preferably, they just let that one drop and play it safe, and the defense says, we'll take it. And it's first and ten. Oh, with a punishing hit, the quarterback goes down. <laughs> sidelines to come in and punt his knitting is superb grim that cross stitching unbelievable and that'll be a touchback i don't feel comfortable giving a massage while we're broadcasting grim I thought the only tie we'd see would be a noose. Instead, they're in a dead heat. Tie game at the end of one. 
And it's first and ten. Second down in a lot. Nicely done. Picks up three on that pass play. Ooh la la. Third down and ten. Nicely done for a first down. Now watch him stomp all over his opponents. I want to take a beast boost injection too. Yeah, now that has weird side effects, Bricks. Murphy Brown! What? I mean, first... And there is nothing in the rule book for that penalty. The ref appears to be cheating. He's just making shit up. They're back up here on first, and the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. First down and forever. left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. This is your brain, and this is your brain on berserker drugs. That... You've got to catch that. down and long. <laughs> and out comes the most underrated position in football, the mighty punter. And he booted a high arcing rainbow. And he snags the punt and looks for open field. I had a dog named Snags. He got hit by a car and died. Pow! With the brain scrambler. Oh. And it's first and ten. I hope you covered your ears, Bricks, because that was a sonic blast dirty. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I'll bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. Take all you About a quarter after three, Grim. But my watch is a bit slow. And it's first and ten. Second down in a very lot. Oh, big catch! Big run! Big touchdown! Yeah, big deal. Mr. Meat for Brains ran with a ball and didn't fall down. Now this 
should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. And he's proud of that? Yeah, that's why he named his clothing company. Boom! And it's first and ten. Well, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a peck ahead. Get the ball, asshole. Hey, asshole, up here. Talking to you. And then a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out. And it's first and ten. What is this, 80s wrestling? Second down and five. No, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a peck ahead. Get the ball, asshole. Third down and five. Well, one yard is better than nothing, but not by much. If they don't pick it up here, they are giving a gift to the deep. We're at the two-minute warning, and we'll take a quick timeout. Well, will you tell the interns to get us some franken dogs and a couple of beers? I'm dry over here. I'll take nachos and a scotch. Uh, at least they can pee for me, too. Wow! The quarterback just threw a sonic blast to his receiver, knocking down the entire... And a perfect strike for a first down! That's a hell of a fourth down play! <laughs> first time out under two minutes. The chess game has begun. It's like chess only. You can kill people. First down and nine. And how about a little dirt sandwich? Second and three. And he rumbles into the end zone for the score. I hope he's not going to dance now. Oh, and the defense just called a time warp dirty trick. And now it's like everything that just happened didn't. Get Brick's mom on the phone quick. I want to use 13,000 of those time warps and undo a mistake she did about 35 years ago. <laughs> Third down and three. The quarterback is controlling the clock like the clock is into it. I know I am. The drive was stalled, and here comes the field goal attempt. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. The 
They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. And it's first and ten. Stump the clock with their first time out, leaving them with two in case they need them. Yeah, just like condoms, hatchets, and wives, huh, Grim? You know, you just summed up why we don't get together outside of work, Bricks. The defense knocked the pass down, and quarterbacks hate that. Second down and ten. and he picks up a new set of downs. They've got one more timeout left, but they've stopped the clock. Why don't they just take the batteries out of the clock, Grim? That would make more sense. And the quarterback signals for a hurry-up offense. Hey, Grim, what's the hurry-up offense? There's no huddle. The offense calls plays at the line of scrimmage and plays really fast. Why would they... And the quarterback drills one in for the first down. Hey, you see that move, baby? No, you didn't. You know why? I'm too fast for you. I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> the second quarter comes to a close as the teams head for the locker room, and we take you to halftime. Brought to you by Monsatan Industries. We make genetically engineered food that is to die for. It's the start of the third quarter, and we are set to go, Bricks. Oh, boy! Where we going, Grim? A carnival? Huh? Uh, we're going to a strip tease show. Where we going? Hey, why don't you settle down? Just pet your rabbit, Lenny. Just pet your rabbit. They need a good return here to set up the offense. They're going to be able to return this one. First and ten. And into the end zone for a touchdown. Once he got his hands on that pass, he was off to the races. Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> Straight through the uprights. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. And 
And it's first and ten. Nice run for five yards. Second down and five. And this ref is definitely on the take. That was a bogus penalty. Second down and long. Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not yawn. Third down and forever. Oh, and that's how you play defense. Of course, he, he could have had an interception, returned it for a touchdown and changed the entire game, but I don't want to nitpick. I do. The guy should have fucking caught it. Well, they couldn't pick up a first down, so now they have to punt. He boomed that one. Let's see if they can get a return. And he's got a chance for a good return here. Oh, great tackle. When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Yeah, most likely in a convalescent home. And it's first and ten. a killer it was right there and then he dropped it oh scumbag is killing me in the fantasy league yeah. second down and ten Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor and it's first and ten Second down in a lot. That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. And it's first and ten. Hit didn't cripple him. It certainly left skid marks. Second down in a very lot. No one was interested in that incomplete pass. Eh, not a ball's feelings are hype. Hey, don't make me explain that balls don't have emotions again, all right? Well, this kick is no guarantee. Sure it is. If he misses, he's fired. Guaranteed. And it's good! You know, when in this league where murder and bribery are cheered, it's good to be good, huh? I mean, can't we all just... Not this shit again. Bricks... I'm stopping it right there. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. <laughs> and it's...
It's first and ten. And he rumbles for nine on that play. And that'll bring up second and one. Dirty trick. The quarterback unleashes a rocket and creates a sonic. But that, my friends, was an all pro NFL hit. <laughs> and it's first and ten. And that's a run for no gain. Then it's not really a run, is it? Second down and ten. That pass play nets them seven yards. Oh, no. I got the hiccups again. What are you supposed to do to get rid of them again? You stick it in a plastic bag, say the alphabet backwards while you set yourself on fire and jump out the window. It ought to stop them. Great throw, great catch, and then put six points on the board. The defense could do anything to stop a thrown at good, man. You mean aside from bribing the ref, killing the quarterback, or actually playing some day? Hey, Bricks, they're going for two here. And the defense stops him cold. That play just got blown to hell. He can get blown to shit. He's going to blow. Where's my little bio? And that brings us to the end of the third quarter. They'll need to fire on all cylinders to make a comeback in the final quarter. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. Second down and more than the QB would like. He had it for a second there. Third down and, well, good luck. about Butterfingers, he should have had that one. And the punter takes a break from knitting on the sidelines to come in and punt. His knitting is superb, Grim. That cross-stitching, unbelievable. He's got the ball now. Let's see what he does with it. Oh, mama! He just knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. And it's first and ten. Boom! That hit's gonna shave a few days off his life. First down and nine. And he just used his beast boost dirty trick, and there's no way to stop him. Not unless, of course, and he pounds the ball into the defense, picking up seven. Second down and two. 
And that was a perfect pass, and he scores handily. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck off. That was just a one-time thing. When I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. And the quarterback is down. Zoom in on his face. I want to see if the little bastard's crying. <laughs> Second down and a lot. He blasted and picks up seven yards right there. Third down and the punter is warming up. somehow and hold on for the first down. This guy has a nice set of hands, Grim. It's the third set of hands he's had shown on today. Looks like it's a good fit. Man, this guy just blew up and he's on fire. I'm not talking about one of those video game fire modes. I mean, literally, he's like burning bacon. Dinner. And like bricks his bowels, he is loose and heading for the end zone. He could go all the way. And it's first and ten. He caught it, and nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. If you get one more bullshit pounding, you get one more for free. You also probably lose the game. Just do me a dead ref dirty trick. I won't even get out of it. First down and long, and they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. First down and a mile. And that's perfect coverage. Nice deflection. Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. Hey, man, I was going to get him now. Hey, <laughs> oh, Third down, and the QB is saying his prayers. And that'll bring us to the two-minute warning. It's do or die now. Hey, no game, though, man. I can't. Jim, on my bad. Yeah, get on the gap. Get on out. Get on out. Well, here comes the punting unit. You know, punters really do know how to party, Bricks. Yeah? Oh, yeah, I have pictures that, uh, well, maybe actually shouldn't discuss this on the air. Nice catch, and he turns on the afterburners. 
Foot returners in this win have a life expectancy of three. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I'll bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim, but my watch is a bit slow. Oh, he's going berserk. The ball carrier better watch. Now the offense is getting kills. This is really a violent game, guys. Take their first time out. Uh, how predictable. Surprise us next time. Call the time out during halftime. Third down and long. And there aren't many things better than a running back blasting through the defense for a big gain. That's a pizza. The quarterback is controlling the clock right now like the clock is into it. He just clock blocked the clock. And the offense goes into a hurry-up to pick up the pace of the game. The game on the line, it's fourth down, and he makes the catch, and they breathe new life. First down, and that's it. That's their last time out. It's them against the other team and the clock. What? Fair. I'm gonna throw a hammer on the field and even the odds. I'm gonna say maybe three yards, but a tough three yards. Second down and seven. And that's a run for no gain. And that'll bring up third down and seven. Perfect pass and a score! Listen to his fans howl. They love him. He came up with a teenage werewolf from the Newton Farm League. I don't know if he's dancing or just minding his territory. <laughs> Brazilian season, dumbass. Actually, I think he's talking about the time warp dirty trick that the defense just played. Still a dumbass, though. And he zips that one in there for a touchdown. And look how happy that little demon is after that score. Ooh, that means he won't drag any souls into the pitch of hell for at least another three hours. Demons are so moody. <laughs> And these guys think kicking is for pussies, Bricks. They're going for two. Yeah, they got big balls, Grim. Yeah, bigger than yours. And they run it in for two points. <laughs> when you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked the loss column. The Grim Bay attackers lose the game. And they lost me 50 bucks. They battled hard, but didn't have enough to get it done. They choked like a bunch of banana choking chimp chumps choking on a bag of chimp dicks. Did you just say choking on a bag of chimp dicks? Yeah. Yeah, that was beautiful. Hey, man. See that? That's right. You can't handle this. You can't handle what I got. 
here. Get the hell out of here, man. Once again, the folks at Evil SM thank our viewing audience and the Newton Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's game was brought to you by Comcrack Entertainment. They're not happy until you're not happy.